guys, you can't even see me. How can I be seen in the first way that I have? It's too low. I mean, it's just a little close, but. All right, y'all, happy Sunday. I am having the worst experience right now. So, I went to work last night, and I went to work last night, and um, I get to the bridge and I, prior to me actually getting, um, I'm reaching like the actual toll booth, I had checked to see how much I had in my account because I didn't, um, remember the last time I had filled, you know, replenished my account. So I get to the bridge and then once I hit the, once I go to the toll booth, I notice that the barricade doesn't go up. And then there's a sign, I mean, and there's a, um, so like uh, one of the signs light up and says, call easy pass and it says low balance. I mean, I've gotten a low balance, you know, low notice before. Cause if you don't have, um, if you have under a, the, the threshold or under a certain amount, it's going to appear as though you have a low balance, even if it's just like a dollar or two below their required amount. So I'm already late because it's raining, there's traffic, all this other stuff. And I'm getting antsy because it's like I'm sitting there and nobody's coming to me. None of the workers are coming to help me. And then um, eventually this lady comes over. And I'm like, hi, I don't know what's going on as I'm taking off my easy pass. I'm like, hi, I don't know what's going on. I, um, I'm assuming that the balance is low, but I do have money on the account. She's like, it's probably too low. So she takes it. She um, attaches it to like another apparatus. I guess reads how much I have on the account. You're gonna have to pay the eight dollars and fifty cents for this trip across the bridge. I'm like, I cool, no problem. I give her the money, and she doesn't give me back my Easy Pass. She's like, you're not gonna get this back. You need to call them and rectify what's going on with your account. So I'm looking like, what is she? Like, girl, what are you talking about? I like I said, are they open tonight? Are they open 24 hours? No, they don't work on weekends. You have to call them on Monday. So mind you, it's Saturday night. Sunday morning, I need the easy pass to come across the bridge. Sunday night, I need the easy pass to go across. Monday morning, I need it to go across. Monday night, I need it to go across. Tuesday morning, I need it to go across. Tuesday night, I need it to go across. Wednesday morning, I need it to go across. So think about how many times I need this easy pass. And for her to tell me that they're not open until Monday morning. So fine. She gives me this little um, paper. It doesn't say any violations or anything, but I guess it basically just proves that I paid the 850. So I go to read like what's on the back of this thing here, because I'm like I'm gonna try to call them as early as possible on Monday, so I can figure this thing out. So this thing is saying that you can pay the you can pay the balance or whatever it is that we're requiring, but you can't request another Easy Pass over the phone. You have to actually come to the um, one of our locations. And then it says that even if you get the easy pass at one of the locations, that does not guarantee that the money you pay will be immediately credited back to the account. It might take 36 hours. I don't even have 36 hours. I don't. I don't have that much time. Like, who's messing with me? Like, who, who, like, who wants to fight? Like, who, who has it out for me today? I don't understand. And the line for those who don't have easy passes are the longest and most 
jam-packed and chaotic lines ever because everybody's trying to cut people off they're acting like they're in the easy pass lane and they're gonna try to like you know slide over to the cash lane it's a lot going on it's like I don't even have time for this it's too expensive I'm not trying to pay 850 that many times this week when I normally pay five dollars and and I like the convenience it's like now it's like it's just I'm not I'm not happy today I'm not in a good mood but it's like what could I do who could I blame nobody I'm not this is the stuff I'm talking about I'm not even I'm not even close to the bridge I'm like minutes from my house and the traffic is starting already I'm crawling if you could look at my background I'm not speeding look look at everybody around me can you see them look like we're really crawling right now and this is what I was telling my dad and he was like are you sure it's really that serious you don't know you don't know because I take this route all the time and as much as I would get frustrated I would know at least when I get to the easy pass it opens up because a lot of people don't have easy passes all the people that cause the traffic are the people who are paying cash now I'm part of the cash people I'm part of the traffic I'm part of the problem like Good morning guys. Happy Monday. It's oh my god, where's my wallet? Oh, I'm not ready. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. Is this the cash line? Wait. Don't tell me. Am I in the cash lane or not? This isn't. <laughs> this is not the start to a good day. cash lane like I pulled up and I'm like this is not going up speaking of easy pass I, I need to go to the headquarters cuz you guys took my easy pass the last time so where is that like right at the light when you pull up look to your right the building right there okay so I got my easy pass and if there's one thing that I am a big one acknowledge me when I'm right but correct me like when I'm wrong, you know what I'm saying? So I go inside, I'm calm, I'm cool. I'm not like, no attitude or anything, but like I'm not even like that. But I go to the teller like, hi miss. <laughs> My easy pass got taken by one of the tellers or whatever. Can you just, I mean, I, one of the people at the tolls, can you just please like, of course, help me get my easy pass back and also explain to me why they took it. She was like, okay. As she asked me some security questions she logs on she's like all right they took it because your account was negative 18 dollars child happy friday everybody it is may 20th may it's may 12th i'm so far i need to, i need to really figure out a, a way to put this so that you guys can actually see me okay this is a little bit better good morning it's 10 50 no 10 25 i'm dressed this morning i am not going to work actually i am headed to an interview i was um offered the opportunity to come into an interview at one of the places that I did my clinical rotations when I was um, completing my hours while I was in school and I'm like excited I haven't been in an interview in so long like I haven't been on an interview since 2012 we're in 17 right now so it's like anyway how are you guys doing today I just came by um, like a print shop to get a couple more copies of my resume printed because for some reason the 
document that I completed the resume on is giving me some type of weird like configuration. Like everything is not aligned. I sent when I send it, it looks good, but if you try to print it, it looks crazy. So I had to save it as a PDF and come get a couple more copies printed just in case they want it. And um, yeah, so I'm heading there now. How are you guys doing? What are y'all doing today? I have to actually, when I'm done, come back home and um, get some things prepared because later on I'm going to one of my homegirls' house and um, I have to make rum punch. So, alrighty, hi right, y'all. I'm gonna check with y'all when I actually get to the spot because I gotta focus and get there. I'm, well, I should be pretty early, so I'll probably chat with you guys when I arrive in front of the location. <laughs> y'all i'm about to go in uh yeah about to go in it went really well i was a little nervous you know not like expressively but more like internally um but i was like listen girl you know what you're talking about let you let your work speak for itself and like just act like you were a little confident like stop you know downing yourself so um yeah it went well so hopefully we'll see if i get a call back hello we come coming that's that stomach back yeah. in jesus name in jesus name no stomach fat <laughs> formed against me shout hey let me get your lighting all right so we have potato salad this is barbecue chicken with no like you know pima or no pepper or anything we have mixed vegetables Popeyes biscuits of course with the chicken because you know we're ghetto and then we have <laughs> and we have uh, candied yams we have corn souffle we have another barbecue chicken this is one that has like the pepper and everything because we have two types of people in this community and we have rum infused waffles. rum infused waffles and what are you doing you got you made it the syrup 